What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's me, Ali Ray, and in today's video we're gonna be doing a get ready with me. You Okay, so we already applied our foundation prior using this foundation, and we're gonna go ahead and use the concealer with the same brand. I like to personally drag it across my eyes like this, and then drag it down a little bit, just like that. Same thing on the other side. This I feel like just gives it more coverage than just doing dots on your face. Then I like to apply some here on my chin. Then what I will do next, I will go in with my bronzer. So I'm just gonna drag this across my cheek like this. I don't really contour. Um, I mean, I have once in my life, but I just don't like the feeling of contouring or I just don't enjoy it as much for my everyday look. Not that I don't enjoy it, but I just don't like it for an everyday look. Okay, so now that we've bronzed, we're gonna go ahead and blend in our concealer. I like to start with the chin first, and I like to kind of put my lip like up, just so that way I get like a no crease line when I blend. Then I like to do the forehead. Then we're gonna go ahead and blend under the eyes. Kind of blend all the way under the eye, make sure it gets all the way up there. And then I blend a little down, just above where bronze. So right about here. Then I get the side of the nose. Then after we're done concealing the face, I like to use my concealer again. And this is where it gets a little different in my makeup routine. I like to underline my eyebrows with concealer before I fill them in. So I basically still follow my eyebrow line. And same thing on the other side. Connect it in the middle like that, just so that they both come out semi-even. I mean, they're not gonna come out perfect because Girls are sisters, not twins. And then I will go ahead and outline them. So for my eyebrows, I use the Morphe Eyebrow Pomade in the shade Mocha. And then I also have the Morphe brush that I use for the brows. Now with my brows, it's different. If I'm going for a more, dram not necessarily dramatic, but if I'm going for a more um, not so natural everyday look, then I'll do them more filled in. For this, I'm just going to outline the bottom of my brow and I'm just following along right above. So same thing, I still bring it down all the way. Then what I do is on the top, I kind of just follow my natural brow and then I curve it around and down. Then what I'll do is I'll fill in the end there just a little bit. And then once more, I will go in at the front here and I will just drag the corner of my brush. I will just drag it kind of upward to create those natural hairs. Then I will brush it, see if I missed any spots there right here I kind of missed a little spot and then I will move on to the next one okay so there you go we filled in the other one and now we're gonna go ahead and blend the concealer what I like to do is I like to start here on like the front of my brow and I drag it downward down to my eyelid then what I like to do is I like to actually slide across so like this to kind of just create that archway. And sometimes it can be a little difficult to kind of get that arch. And same thing on this side. Then with in the middle, what we're gonna do is we're gonna drag it kind of upward to create that frontward kind of um, shape to it. And then drag whatever's left. I'll get my finger and I'll kind of just rub over everything to make sure I've gotten everything there and kind of just blend it more on my eyelid. And then what I will do is I will go back in with my spoolie and I will brush my brows upward. Okay, so now that the brows are filled in, they're concealed and they're brushed and ready to go, we're gonna move on to our eyes and apply our mascara. Um, as you can see, I already have lashes on. That's gonna be a different tutorial for a different video because I get asked about that a lot. But we're gonna use this mascara here. And yes, you can apply mascara to the lashes. So we're gonna apply this. I like to go over them like that and under them. So over and under. And I like to do my bottom lashes. So the mascara is on. The last couple things I like to do is I like to get a little bit of blush. I just like to apply it right to the front of my cheeks right here, just like that. Same thing on the other side. Then the next thing I like to go in and do is I take my little brush here and I like to highlight, I know. 
I don't like to go too crazy though. So I use this one here and I like to highlight my nose, just the tip of my nose, like that there. I will add a little bit to my sides here, just like that. And the last and final thing I like to do is I'll get like this beauty rag that I use, or I like to call it my beauty rag. But I'll use like a rag or a wipe usually. Um, and then I just kind of wipe and then what I like to do is I go in with Aquaphor. I use this for literally everything. You can buy it at Target. And then what I like to do is I use this uh, lipstick in this color. Um, it doesn't have a name, but it's just kind of like a pinkish color. And I kind of just dab like that, like just like a few dots. Um, and then I just kind of blend it in just to give like a pop of color to my lips because I'm not really big on lipsticks at all but just like a pop of color is what I'm good with so and there you guys have it this is my everyday final look that's it for today's video guys thank you so much for watching if you're new here welcome to my channel make sure you hit the subscribe button down below click the bell in the top right to get notified every time I post a video every Friday and I will see you guys next week